Hey guys, what's up? Wade Bush Iverson here. Uh, an effort to decrease the length of my mail days, uh, or the length of my videos for my mail days, I'm going to do them more frequently um, so that there's not as many. So that's the extent of the mail today, but there is two 101s in here, um, some encapsulated stuff, quad autographs, some really nice stuff. So uh, without further ado, I am going to get going. First of all, from Topps Tribute for the Pitcher's PC of Daniel Hudson. I don't have an autograph of him yet. I have his fellow teammate Ian Kennedy from uh, the Gypsy Queen set. No, sorry, I have Ian Kennedy from the Topps set. But this is a very beautiful on-card encapsulated autograph from Topps Tribute, number to 99. Panini, take note, this is a really cool idea. Only thing that I didn't like about the Topps Tribute is there's no relic autographs. Uh, just autographs and just relic cards. That's my only complaint about that set. But, very beautiful card indeed. Next we have, for the Blazers PC, Joel Prisbilla. When he was with the Bucks. Nice on-card autograph from SP Authentic. He is now the starting center for the Blazers, now that they got rid of a bunch of players. Very nice card there. The next we have a one of one, a very nice printing plate from Top Stadium Club. This is the magenta plate. A big owl. You can see one of one magenta plate. And also on the back you have the one of one sticker. If I can get the light right, which I can't, but it does say one of one there. Yeah, you guys can't see. But it's a very nice card, and I'm glad to add it to the collection. Next we have a Chris Bosch SP Authentic. On, no, not on card, autograph. I have a few of these, but uh, always nice to pick up another Bosch auto for the collection. Next, we have a quad autograph for the Felton PC of Raymond Felton, Bobby Jackson, Rajon Rondo, and Keon Dooling. Four star signatures. Very, very beautiful and nice card. I must say, I'm going to have to get it out of this top loader because it's the wrong size. And I'll worry about that later. Alright, moving on. Two cards left. Next we have this. The Chromogra Chromographs X-Fractor of Raymond Felton. These are really rare and very hard to find. Um, the Chromograph set in itself is pretty hard. Uh, it's kind of like the Youthquake set. 0809, but this was for uh, his rookie year 0506, and that's numbered 1 out of 9. Whereas normally I believe they are unnumbered, just short printed, I think probably probably close to 25 is the normal one, but these X-Fractors are numbered 1 out of 9. My rookie, jer or my uh, jersey number, number 9. Got a game later today, wish me luck. Then for the nasty one, I don't often do slow rolls, but I'm going to do one here. Now let's take it out of here. All right, here we go. Take a look at that. Do 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 do. I'll swing it around this way. The full letter R. Game used, selective swatch. I believe this is from Topps Big Game of the CB4 Chris Bosch. There's the back. You see the Chris Bosch 101 Raptors logo patch. So that comes out of the front part, the Raptors part of the jersey. And judging by the white surroundings, that is his home uniform from that year. It says you have just received an authentic one of one relic card from the Topps Company. The full patch on the front of this card comes from a game worn jersey. Now, most of these patch autographs that are like this are from event used, um, so it's a little more rare to have them as uh, actual game used as opposed to event worn. But I'm really excited to add that. I'm going to cut my video there so that it is not ridiculously long. Appreciate it, guys. Uh, really cool mail day, in my opinion.